how can lack of sexual education affect our intimate relationships? What is the impact of unrealistic expectations from movies and TV shows on sexual life? Hello to all lovers of psychology and sexuality. Today, we will unveil the sexual curiosities of women. If you are interested in these topics, make sure to subscribe and activate the notification bell to not miss our future videos. Also, leave us comments and share your experiences in the section below. Let's get started. Lack of sexual education can affect our intimate relationships by causing misunderstandings, anxieties, and unhealthy practices. It contributes to a lack of communication about desires and boundaries, making it difficult to build satisfying relationships. Comprehensive sexual education is essential to promote sexual health and positive intimate relationships. Unrealistic expectations from movies and TV shows can generate insecurities and unnecessary pressures in sexual life. These exaggerated representations affect self-esteem and emotional connection in relationships. Open communication is essential to cultivate a healthy sexual life. Recognizing that media representations do not always reflect reality. Sexual fantasies. Many women turn to sexual fantasies during masturbation to increase excitement and pleasure. These fantasies can vary widely and may include erotic situations, locations, or imaginary individuals. Sexual motivations. The University of Texas conducted research identifying 237 different motivations for having sex. Interestingly, having children and relieving tension are no longer the main reasons. Other motivations include getting closer to God, burning calories, returning a favor, changing the topic of conversation, and even getting rid of a headache. This study demonstrates that human sexual motivations are extremely complex. Sexual pleasure at all stages of life. Sexual pleasure is not limited to youth. People of all ages can enjoy a satisfying and fulfilling sex life. Sexuality is an integral part of human well-being at all stages of life. Sexual response cycle. The traditional model of the sexual response cycle includes the phases of excitement, plateau, orgasm, and resolution, although sexual experience can vary widely among individuals. Sexual therapy. Masturbation is often used in sexual therapy as a way to help women overcome sexual problems, such as anorgasmia or lack of sexual desire. Sexual therapy. Sexual therapy involving working with a therapist specialized in sexual issues can be effective in addressing underlying emotional and psychological concerns related to premature ejaculation. Sexuality and culture. Sexuality is strongly influenced by cultural factors, such as social norms, religious beliefs, and family traditions, which can lead to a wide diversity of attitudes and sexual practices in different parts of the world. Sexuality and gender identity. Sexuality is inherently linked to gender identity, but it is important to remember that gender identity does not determine a person's sexual orientation. People of all gender identities can have a wide variety of sexual orientations. Sexuality and the elderly. Sexuality has no expiration date. Many older people continue to have sexual relationships and enjoy intimacy in their golden years. Sexuality and advertising. Sexuality is often used in advertising to sell products, leveraging sexual attraction and gender stereotypes to capture public attention and drive sales. Sexuality in literature. Sexuality has been a recurring theme in literature throughout history, from classic works to contemporary novels, exploring a wide range of experiences and perspectives. Sexuality in old age. Sexuality knows no age, and many older adults continue to enjoy an active and satisfying sex life. It's important to recognize and respect the sexuality of older individuals. Sexually transmitted diseases can affect people of all ages, races, sexual orientations, and genders. They do not discriminate and can affect anyone who engages in unprotected sexual activity. Shared bath ritual. 
Sharing a relaxing and sensual bath can be an intimate way to initiate foreplay, creating a romantic atmosphere conducive to erotic exploration. Shockwave therapy for erectile dysfunction. Shockwave therapy is a non-invasive treatment that uses acoustic waves to improve blood flow to the penis, which may help improve erectile function in some men. Skin fetishism. Some people experience sexual arousal by touching, caressing, or even licking another person's skin. This fetish may be related to tactile sensation and physical intimacy. Sleep disorders and erectile dysfunction. Sleep apnea, a disorder characterized by interruptions in breathing during sleep, has been associated with an increased risk of erectile dysfunction in some studies, suggesting a connection between sleep quality and sexual health. Sleep paralysis is a terrifying experience where a person temporarily wakes up unable to move. Occasionally, people report sexual experiences during these episodes. Smile. A sincere and kind smile is attractive to many people as it is associated with kindness and empathy. In certain African countries like South Africa and Botswana, specific sex education programs have been created for people with disabilities, recognizing the importance of addressing their unique health and sexuality needs. In South Korea, sexual education focuses on preventing internet and pornography addiction, as well as promoting healthy relationships and consent in a context of high academic and social pressure. Speed of sperm. During ejaculation, approximately 100 million sperm are expelled, capable of traveling at an astonishing speed of up to 18 kilometers per hour, thanks to muscular contractions. This speed is essential for competing in their race towards the egg. Standing positions. Although less common, some women enjoy standing sexual positions, such as against the wall or leaning standing, which can add an element of adventure and risk to the sexual experience. Stress response. Foreplay can help women release tension and reduce stress, allowing them to relax and fully immerse themselves in the sexual experience. Studies on the clitoris. Despite the importance of the clitoris in female sexual response, there has been a lack of research on this organ compared to the penis. However, there has been an increased focus on clitoral research in recent years. In sub-Saharan African countries, sexual education programs in secondary schools include classes on sexual and reproductive rights, gender equality, and prevention of sexual violence. Taboo and acceptance. Some cultures may consider certain fetishes taboo, while in others they are more accepted or even celebrated. This reflects cultural differences in the perception of sexuality and individual expression. Tantric massage techniques. Tantric massage is a form of foreplay that focuses on channeling sexual energy through the body, which can lead to experiences of ecstasy and deeper connection between partners. Tantric sex is a practice that focuses on emotional connection and deep intimacy. It emphasizes control of arousal and can lead to prolonged and satisfying sexual experiences. Human sexuality is a fascinating and diverse field that never ceases to amaze us. Sexual curiosities unveil the wonderful complexity of the human experience in the intimate realm. As we explore and understand these facts, it is crucial to remember that each individual is unique in their sexual experience. Respecting and communicating with your partner are the keys to a satisfying and healthy sexual life. Sexual education and understanding are essential tools for fully embracing our sexuality.